symbols, devil horns, devil tails, baby devils in diapers, pitchforks, six point star. Yes, these, this is the same disciples. In a city known for its fearsome super gangs, criminal enterprise like the mob, gangs, Chicago has its own culture from graffiti on the walls to how the south side and the north side are separated. In Chicago, it's where you're born that defines who you are, not your race. This is gang life. Cartel got me working for the big faces Federally got my car full of brick cases Hit the pin with a grin, there ain't no faking Eyes picked to my back for my shoelaces God out, should've seen the look on they faces All jealous cause your boy stacking hella paper Set up by the crew, they done put a banger In the trunk of my car and left me to hang there No thing, then attorney went and beat the case Got a job digging holes for minimum wage Had a dream that Cato said he proud of me Stay here, don't leave, keep doing your thing Quit the drugs, but you know I went back to selling Six times failing, I went back to prison Got my head right, got my bread right Push these weights like a kilo in a tailpipe Trying to do right, I got a mission Trying to get back to my boys in the prison The old me's gone, I ain't never gonna miss them From wrong to strong, stay true to the vision From wrong to, to strong From wrong to strong from wrong to, to strong From wrong to strong Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back. My name is JC. I am Wrong Strong. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell, give me thumbs up, come thumbs down, doesn't matter. Just give me something. If you are part of my Wrong True crew, Raza, familia, what's up? Suban a suburban. Let's put some gas in it because we're going to go cruise around Pilsen and we cannot run out of gas there because <laughs> they'll get us. Welcome back <laughs> to another episode of Gang Life in Chicago. We are in the neighborhood Pilsen and this street gang started in Pilsen in the 1960s, but was founded in 1959 by King Satan. Yes, you heard me right. King Satan. <laughs> Had some pretty cool names back then. <laughs> Pilsen is a neighborhood that way back in the day, you did not see Starbucks like you do today. <laughs> Bilson is a beautiful neighborhood with a lot of culture, history, food, you name it. But it also was home to a lot of party crews and street gangs that started way back in the day. The Saint Disciple was founded mainly by Czechoslovakian and Polish kids. But they took in Mexican youth. They started on 15th Street in Tallman. And for sure, and quickly began to be a gang problem by the 1970s. There's a lot of articles of the same disciples taking care of business. A lot of their members start to show up in the prison system. And believe it or not, the prison system is a huge network of spiders webs that go from prison to prison to prison to prison. Remember, we have more prisons more prisons in the United States than we do schools and colleges. So, yeah, there's a lot of them. So it becomes this big web, right? And you have one to two to three of the same gang in different prisons all over the United States. So you see what I mean? It becomes a connection where you're connecting the dots. So they became pretty big in prison too. From the 80s to the 90s, the SD spread out like wildfire. They, they just, they grew over 40 suburbs to 22 states. They became actually one of the largest gangs in the city around those, those years. 
uh, using smart business sense uh, like it's in their laws for open business um, they uh, opened up a lot of legit several businesses in their neighborhoods and actually this is what makes gangs organizations whatever you want to call it stick around for the long term because now they own real estate that means that that will probably be one of their main headquarters where they'll be at all the time hanging out uh, neighborhoods are always going to be there for a long time if you go to 26th street and you look around at the businesses there's five five point transmissions corona this uh el rey that all these businesses do you, do you honestly think that that's just coincidence that you they live there on in chi town and and it's it's called five points uh, king transmit no it's 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 been dudes that have been part of the organizations that have opened up legit businesses because that is their home. That's just where they're going to live. There's families that have been in Chicago since the 40s that still live in the same house. Ha handed down, I've met, I met an Ambro that, like, his kid was an Ambro, his dad was an Ambro, his father was an Ambro, his great grandpa. They were, like, all from, like, from the beginning, so it, sometimes it get it gets passed down, and and you can't you can't help it, you know the SDs. Uh, I believe because I seen it with my own eyes, spread like wildfire because there was there was a lot of unity, there was a lot of leadership. This is when Gizmo was still alive. Gizmo was was going from neighborhood to neighborhood, making sure everybody was doing what they had to do. You know, meetings, dues, all that. You know that year. I want to say in 91st, the early 90s, we had one of the biggest SD uh, uh, days at, in LaGrange Park where everybody showed up from everywhere with their, you know, airbrush shirts. And it's also the year where the power struggle started with the SD. They started to face such a huge power struggle because they were doing really well. And when something is going really, really well, well, you know, there's bad energies sometimes in the universe that want to see you not be happy, not do good. So it's when the big power struggle happened and, you know, uh, uh, Gizmo was murdered. And it's crazy because, you know, watching that gangland stuff where, you know, where Gizmo was killed in, in that gangway, uh, a lot of people don't know this, but I lived in front uh, Valerie's uh parents owned that house and i was living in front i met him when he uh when i came home king Ali came home i met him i went upstairs and i took some stuff to him and then i came back downstairs but that night when he got killed back there we were all at the house but we ended up going to fort city and we got into a big big uh uh fight and we all got locked up um you know we were questioned about that murder the next day but it, it it was it was crazy because we we spent the whole night at uh at the police station on 63rd and you know gizmo gizmo was a, lot, a good dude man i met him a couple of times when all that stuff started to happen i met with him and baby d one time and the feds were were hot they were trying to record everything um the sds were starting to become a big big power player for you know a uh, family out of mexico cartel and the feds were, were were on them and shit just started to come down man come down really fast and uh, we witnessed one of the biggest power struggles i've ever seen an organization have and that was you know when gizmo got killed at uh the sd split into two 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 sides and they just went at it you know with each other and it was crazy because uh, it was all over greed, all over greed and power. It, it was, Gizmo didn't deserve what he got. And, you know, he was actually trying to fix everything to make it to where, how it was before with everything being legit with the uh, the uh, dues and the meetings and, and all that stuff. But, you know, like I always tell, I always should say, man, in all, all my videos, this life, 
I don't deserve, I don't wish this life on nobody because it's either you're dead or you're in prison or you lose everything and it's not worth it. At the end of the day, man, I share these videos because this is just history of Chicago. Chicago has always been a gangster -ass city and has always had organizations that are gangster and take care of business. This is just history. My name is JC. I am Wrong and Strong. Live savage. Don't judge nobody. Give somebody a hug. And if you live easy, life is hard. If you live hard, life is easy. I'll catch you guys on the rebound.